so Bethesda announced recently that they are rebooting uh, the Elder Elder Scrolls Skyrim top to bottom with mods for uh, play for a PC, PlayStation Three, Xbox One, or PlayStation Four. I'm sorry, that's my bad. Oh, oh God. Uh, <laughs> People are gonna, I'm gonna I'm gonna get murdered. Uh, <laughs> she doesn't um, live. Yeah, I I'm not a PlayStation person, so sorry. Um, but and a lot of people were worried when they said they were remastering it that it was just oh it's going to be slightly better graphics, but it's still going to be grainy with gl- glitches. Now the whole game is getting redone. The graphics are going to look like they do in Fallout 4, but the game will still be the same. Dun, dun, dun. Which, and uh, I'm yeah, so that's awesome. excited. Ooh, I'm right there with you. Skyrim, Skyrim is so good. And it kind Here of goes. goes on the topic that I think we've talked about before, is that PC gamers are getting this for free if they've already had it. Yeah, which is unfair. But Xbox, um, uh, don't, don't listen to me. Um, Xbox and PlayStation has to pay for it. Uh, which is $60 that I've already paid for Skyrim itself. Which I, I mean, Technically, it's not a backwards compatibility, so I guess it wouldn't be free. But at the same time, it's like, can I at least get a reduced price? I don't know. Really, I'm right there with uh, you. I think that's bullshit. I mean, it's not that I'm not willing to pay for the full price for the beautiful Skyrim that I want, but really, please, just, I don't, how, how, I don't know how I'm trying to say it. Don't cash grab us. Well, that, yeah, definitely. And also, I mean, as far as I also know, all of the DC or DLC, huh, Jesus. All of the DLC will also be included, remastered. Nice. Yeah, I think the mods will be good too because some of those mods were really funny. Yeah, I can't wait but, to do the mods. I just hope they uh, put in a VR thing for it because that game would be so beautiful in VR. I hope they add in a thing for that. I really. Oh yeah. Couple that with the Thomas the Train equals dragons and mod, yeah, you know you'll have nightmares for weeks. That's true too. Uh, no, you put like uh, Barney as the dragons, and shit will get real real quick. What the fuck? Fun? It, why why not just do Pennywise as all fucking Khajiit? Oh, that would be awesome. I know, like, three people right now that would never fucking touch the game again if I put that mod in. Oh, my God. Clowns wow. everywhere. Yes. Khajiit is innocent. Khajiit eight people. Little children, to be exact. No, fuck you, Khajiit. You're dying. I'd slaughter everyone. Khajiit is innocent. Khajiit has wears. <laughs> Khajiit has many wears. Oh God! Some very, no, don't say very, that one. very dark and naughty wears. <laughs> Pet me and I'll uh, hurt. Wow! But, uh, in, in all seriousness, I mean, I, I'm gonna have to agree with you guys on this one. I mean, granted, you know, I, I'm PC and they're just gonna hand it to me. But at that same time, I feel like they should just hand it to you too. I mean, there's if they need proof of purchase, I mean, fuck, and, you know, look at the several hours you have invested already on the game and everything. You got achievements. Man. 200 plus. Yeah, exactly. My point improvement. I mean, I watched... It was the first time ever, um, because my brother has moved down here, and he's got a uh, 360. And I watched the play on it, and looking at it graphically-wise, I I see a difference between 
where it sits just now between like the Xbox and actual PC. And I was like, huh, that's not rendered like that on mine. And that looks different. And that, you know, so I can only imagine what, you know, you know, when he pushes and gets a Xbox one and gets this, cause I know he'll get this. Uh, and you know, the, how different the graphics are going to look then as compared to now where I already see a very big difference. Oh, so yeah. with that being said, I'm kind of interested in how much further they're going to even take the PC one, honestly, because I mean, no offense guys, but I feel like the uh, graphically it's already a few steps up. Right. But then again, I can also adjust my graphics even further than you guys can. So it, it, it's it's kind of like, you know, racing, you know, if you're racing, you know, an Indy car versus a potato almost in trying to compare the two together, it's not really going to ever mesh up well. So, with- well, I'm getting that PS uh, 4.5, so I can't wait to see what it looks like on that. Yeah, yeah, 4.5. I just, it, it, you guys know where I stand on, on doing that. I feel like they're, they're gouging you poor console guys. So yeah, like, and it's like having you, to buy this and having to buy the four point five, and you know, oh, and then the slim, you know, Nero super sleek dragon hunting PlayStation seventeen. You know, yeah. I, I feel like they they attack you guys more because it's like, well, either they do or they don't. Well, see, and they can easily rectify that with, oh, let's look at their achievements or trophies. And even then they could be like, okay, they just ran the game, which there's no rentals anymore. But then you could go, okay, well, then what if we trade in our copies for it? Like, proof of purchase. Here, here's our copy. Now give us the yeah. game. Like, you know, they could do that, but they want that money. But I'm Bethesda, really but, Sorry. you know, I, I'm not going to get too mad about it because Bethesda's always been good to their customers and to their fan base. With all the DLC that we get, that's a actually really good DLC, not just like, oh, here's a skin pack for like ten dollars. We actually get like a whole new story and a whole bunch of cool shit. And Call Infinity Ward. Call yeah, and then we're getting you know a lot of mods huh. and stuff with this, not just the graphical up boost. And then I bet you they're gonna put a VR mode into it. So I'm not too mad about having to pay, but at the same time, it's like they get it to free at least hook us up like with like what Monkey Paul said a reduced price for it or something. Yeah. Honestly, my whole thing is that I'm just excited to see Skyrim in, like, Super HD. Like, if Skyrim looks like the Commonwealth, oh, sweet Jesus. Just a lush. Ugh. It would be awesome. And hopefully, it will be a hell of a lot easier to climb up a goddamn mountain. Nope. And that'll never be in any Elder Sh- in any Bethesda game. I'm sorry. I am a Khajiit. I have four paws and a goddamn tail. Yeah, I should be able to climb a mountain without much problem. That's the best reason to have a horse in that game. It's just for climbing the mountains. It's yep. the only time I use them. <laughs> they defy gravity! I know, which is awesome. <laughs> Fuck physics. <laughs> and this will be. This is the time we'll make uh, Carmageddon play a fucking Elder Scrolls game. What is it? Yep. <laughs> wow. I said, this will be the time we make you play an Elder Scrolls game. Oh. I've been barking up that tree for years. She's not going to play it. Probably not. What I'm 27 years old and playing Minecraft. I mean, come on. <laughs> like it's hey, a trigger hey. and you tell her that it's a new Fallout game. She hasn't she played Fallout. Play Fallout. She's, She's never played a Bethesda game. God damn it. What are wrong with you, woman? We're going to have Sorry, to get her into I, this one. I apologize. I lost the happy, but the happy's back. Okay, so, like, most of my game, I used to be, like, Call of Duty only all the time because I don't know why, but in my young mind, I didn't think the other games existed. So, for the longest time, Call of Duty was all I ever played. And then I started playing Borderlands. And at first, I actually got pissed off at that because it wasn't Call of Duty. Like, I got to, like, level 9. And then boycotted it for like six months. And then my friend Josh, he was like, no, no, you have to give it a chance. Now I'm fucking addicted to it. I've been addicted to Borderlands for years now. But- <laughs> I know, and you will be addicted to this. Trust me, yeah. you will be. Look, I've been telling everybody, the reason I don't play Fallout, the reason I don't play Skyrim, is because I also have a 40-hour-per-week job. And I don't like the whole 
having so to battle, battle with my whether I want to go to work or whether I want to call in to play video games. Because then, if I call in, I technically get paid to play video games. Because see, call in days are paid. And so, see, yeah, and with Bethesda games, that's when people call in. And I don't need that in my life yet. <laughs> Come on, you gotta try it with us, please. You'll love it. it. You will love it. I will consider it. Consider it. Where is it? Where I was just thinking about it? 4K resolution dragon slaying. That sounds awesome. And I will have that with that new PS4 Neo. Fuck. I should never have left my train. Shit. Somebody's yes. off in their own world. You shouldn't have left it. No. Now you're going to have left die. your dream. <laughs>